I just thought, you know what, I can do this. I think I can, I can get up and uh, represent people in court. So I put my name down for the bar and the rest is history. There is nothing, nothing better than that moment where you have completed textbook cross-examination and you've got that witness right where you want them. <laughs> and I just think that's just awesome. It doesn't matter how many years you've been at the bar or how senior you are, um, there are still moments where you know it, it might be quiet at work, you're not sure when you're going to get another brief, um, what your next month might, might look like. Um, and then there are times when it's just so busy, you just think, you know, when it rains, it pours. And so there's sometimes no happy medium. Uh, I find that the most challenging. When I can actually see um, that I've helped someone, when I can actually see that in front of me, those moments are just absolutely priceless. I would like to see more women putting up, putting themselves forward um, for positions on Bar Council, putting themselves forward for positions on um, uh, barristers' committees, Bar Committees, um, so they can influence change th through that. Um, and I think if we see more women um, being involved um, in those areas, I think we're going to see more women staying at the top and more women therefore becoming silks and, and applying, uh, feeling confident to apply to become silks. Just come along and have a go and realise that it's not the be all or end all. You've come into the bar doesn't mean you have to stay forever. If you don't like it, you can leave. <laughs> but I don't think you will. <laughs>